welcome 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 you liberals I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful um, like shares and support um, this is your new year 2018 reading and the year that you're going to be dealing with is the year of the hermit now the air of the hermit is that a lot of you secrets are going to be coming out you're going to be working with the scorpions um, this is a water year it's going to be an emotional year for you guys there's a lot of information secrets and information there is the time that you're going to be taking this year the time in this year to find out who you are as a true spiritual being okay so we have um, this energy that is coming up so we're going to be looking at this year this year for you guys a water year the zodiac energy is your zodiac energy so it's a lot of stuff that is going to be happening for you guys you guys have to look within for inner guidance the wheel of fortune is here beside the energy of justice which is your own energy vibration then we have some people that are going to be finding out who they are then we have corporation organization powers um, power struggle in this year we um, um, with organization and we have the energy of the lovers okay some of you are going to be divorcing and all these things are going to be coming up so let's see um, what are the energies are coming out if your birthday is from the hermit comes up twice you guys can see if your birthday is from um, the um, 16th until if your birthday is from the 16th until the king of cups is here so some of you could be getting in relationship with the lovers because the lovers are here twice um the lovers are here twice so you could have the energy of the king of cups um we have uh, money coming in we have a transition with organization and end to a situation with an organization and we have the knight of pentacles some of you are dealing with the knight of pentacles in an organization so let's see what else is coming in a lot of you are going to be connecting with the energy of the lovers money is going to be coming in um, to you there is going to be a message that is coming there is some blocks and the ending of an legal situation there's a lot of talking um, that you're going to be dealing with power struggle okay you women are going to be affected um, in this year but you men also you women are going to be some of you could be divorcing um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion let's go within and look at the year for the people who were born on um, the 15th because uh, it's the 15th until the 21st you have the energy of the hermit it's going to be a year that you're going to go within to find out how can you um, manifest more money coming in your life how are you going to be manifesting more money coming in your life this is going to be a good year for you guys because what you're doing is basically going within and your angels and guides are going to be providing you and aligning you with the right energies and with these right energies you're going to be learning how to manifest more money in your life and this is going to be very positive and very good because um, the hermit with the ace of Pentacles is a new start to your financial structure and your financial stability and this is going to be opening up new doors of opportunity that is going to make you make a lot of money so your year is actually money 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 um, some people do not like the eight, the year of the hermit but the year of the hermit is coming up here in a very very positive way because as you can see and as you're realizing uh, by going within it's going to be aligning you how you can much better heal your financial situation so um, this year is going to be a wonderful year for you guys when it comes to your financial stability as we look at the people who were born on um, the 17 you have the energy of the wheel of fortune and the wheel of fortune is coming in and it is bringing light to a situation a wheel of fortune is coming in bringing light to a situation and this situation is going to bring you some good news that is about to, to come in so it is a positive year is a positive year of uh, um, positive stability coming in your life um, the hermit is like 
the, the 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 energy vibration the hermit is here twice so you guys um write down the number nine and the number six the energy of the hermit is here twice and the, the you guys are going to be aligning with yourself you guys are going to be really 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 being very positive and aligning with yourself and information is going to be coming out and good news if you have a book to publish um, this year between now and your next birthday is a good year if you are blogging between now and your birthday you're going to be picked up by people who are listening to what you have to say or you finding information for yourself so as we look at the 18th you have justice 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 with a conflict whatever the conflict was it has now ended okay so um, if your birthday is on um, the um, 18 um, and you're dealing with conflicts you have been dealing with a long-lasting conflicts it is now come to an end and uh, this conflicts is now blocked no more no more it's as if in this in this the coming year after your birthday you're going to be seeing that all the conflicts all the situation if you have a legal situation whatever the situation is it's going to be aligning and coming out of your life and this is going to be very 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 good okay this blockage it blocks conflicts that is going on okay then on the 19th uh, for the people who were born on the 19th this is a year of you trying to find out who you are you're going to be looking at people and relationships around you you're going to be aligning yourself with the energy of people and relationships around you and this is going to be wonderful and it's going to be positive um, a lot of you are going to be connecting with the right people at the right time some of you could be connecting with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man over the age of 40 this is going to be a very very positive relationship because this man brings only love and affection in your life this man only wants um, positive situation and energies and he is going to be bringing wonderful positive energies into your life um, this is a soulmate a lot of you are going to be aligning and really finding out that there is a friend who is a soulmate who you weren't aware of and weren't aligning with and you're going to be realizing that a friend is going to become a soulmate to you and this is um, going to be so wonderful so positive this is going to be extremely good there's a lot of love that is coming from this person whoever this person is there is a lot of love that is coming from this person as we look at um, uh, 16 17 18 19 20 because we're going to it was supposed to be um, the 20th but it's the 22nd um, we have the energy of uh, um, um, some of you uh, needs to um, release um, 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 the power that you have you need to just release the power that you have you need to release the ego um, some of you are going to be st um, building stability in your life the energy of the transformation uh, some of you in business some of you in I position that could be ending and a transformation is coming in where you're deciding to take a less stressful powerful job this is always the energy of this there's going to be a lot of uh, talking a lot of people talking a lot of um, constructive criticism that is going to be coming in for you guys who were born on the 19 so do not be um, array with this because um you are going to be seeing um, this energy um, coming in okay you're really going to be seeing this energy come in for the people who were born on the 21st um, you have a situation with an organization and there is the Knight of Pentacles whoever this person is it's a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and it has to do with a child so um, some of you could be fighting to um, have a uh, um, connection with your children uh, some of you could be fighting for a new start so if there's a legal cost to the battle um, this is going to be ending in a positive note it is a karmatic situation that has transpired in your life it is coming from past lifetime if you have accosted a battle with a child this is coming from past lifetime it could be also the start of something for you and this is coming from a past lifetime that this person 
who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn tries to block you in whatever way um, they try to do this but it did not uh, um, work out in their favor you're still having this new start so this is good so um, as we move on we're looking at the people who were born um, on the 22nd this is a year of love it's a, it's a year of exchange in love and it's going to affect most of the women especially women and children this is a year that is going to be affecting you guys but in a very very positive year positive place positive situation it's going to be affecting you but in a positive way some of you are going to be connecting with new partners because the energy of the lovers come out so a lot of you are going to be also bringing in new crystal children that is going to be coming in and aligning yourself in your life and this is good as I look at the year for you guys it's a, it's a very very positive year the energy of this king coming in a lot of you are going to be connecting with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and this is someone who is an older person it could, you could be connecting in relationship it could be your father but the relationship is going to get better and it's going to be very very extremely positive now what I should advise you is that each and every one of these energies energy of the hermit all of you are going to be affected with this because you have the energy of the hermit which is the energy of the year and money is not going to be a problem in um, the year 2018 because you're just about starting the year 2018 money is not going to be such a problem even the people who are deciding to leave their jobs to go for something that is much comfortable much suitable something that aligned with them there is really not going to be such of a stress you're still going to be financial stability because this energy is the energy of the year for you guys and this is only for the people who were born on the 16th to the 22nd you're going to be realizing that all of these energies are basically going to affect you guys it's basically going to affect you guys in a lot of positive way so here we are seeing the energy and aligning with the energy which is um, you know a lot of good news are going to be coming out but money about a message about money is going to be coming out this is going to be um, this block let's look at this block and see um, what is going to be happening to this block because whatever the conflict is it's going to be blocked whatever the conflicts whatever that was happening it's basically going to be blocked and the Sun energy comes out so for the people who were born on the 18 whatever the blocked and the conflict and whatever that was there that was coming out you're going to be seeing that this is going to be coming out so positive news is going to be aligning you guys with money what I can also say is that for the people who were born on the 16th um, you have the number 9 energy um, uh, 7 34 and 1 so 1 7 9 and 34 okay for the people who were born on the 17th you have the energy of 1 um, 9 10 another nine so for you guys and this is good that I went back over for the people who were born on the 17 there's something that is going to end in your life you have three times nine two times nine thus the hermit is nine and two plus seven is nine so um, this is a wake-up call for you and this is um, it's as if your spirit guides are going to be waking you up the wheel of fortune this is a wake-up call for you and this we wake-up call could be something that is saying look at your financial situation look some of you are going to be finding out in this year especially the people who were born on the 17th that some bank uh, organization institutes has been stealing from you you will um, regain um, the, the the financial so we have again one um, twice nine ten and twenty seven as we move forward let's look and see what is happening the energy of justice for you guys is going to be a positive year this is your energy vibration this is the energy vibration that you carry whatever conflicts whatever um, things that comes up it's going to be working out just as if it comes up it's just going to be flowing out so you have the energy of 11 5 
um, 3 and 21 11 5 3 and 21 now the energy of the Sun comes out which is your bonus card so this is going to be a perform wonderful year because whatever the conflicts whatever the conflicts whatever conflict was um, that was creating um, it's going to be um, really eased up as we move forward and we look at the energy of the on the the ghost and the hangman what is transpiring and what is happening for you guys is that some of you are going to be really seeing um, that a friend that you have was really your twin flame or your soulmate this is someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion now as we look at this energy we see the hangman and uh, you are going to be realizing that oh my god this person has been my friend for such a long time but he is really my twin flame or my soulmate this is going to be a beautiful relationship you have the energy of 12 and 3 um, 6 18 and 9 okay you guys have a lot of 9 um, in this year which 9 is uh, you need to finish a cycle 9 is the ending of a cycle and a new beginning that is coming in as we look at the people who were born on the 20th you have uh, 4 um, the debt is 13 another 4 so the spirit the spirit the guides are going to be coming in you have 12 which is 3 so um, this is really good this is 4 um, this is 13 4 12 and 3 wonderful numbers write them down use them as you choose to as we look at the people who were born on um, the 21st you have 5 1 3 4 and 13 so um, 4 5 1 13 this is really positive there is a costable battle that you people are trying to deal with and it's going to be coming out in your favor as we move on and if it's not a costable battle it is a new start and someone whoever this person in is in the year 2000 after your birthday um, you're going to be having a lot of confrontation with someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it could be your child's mother or your child's father um, but this co conflict of battle, cost of the battle, is going to be coming in. But for most of you, it's a new start. As we move on, we're looking at the energy of the lovers to um, 29, which is the latest, is going to affect the latest, especially um, the ladies um, who were born on the 22nd. Duality is going to be playing out for you. Um, this is six, uh, the energy of six, two. So, some of you ladies have to make a decision about a relationship. You have to make a decision about a soulmate or a twin flame. Um, whether or not you're going to be ending this relationship in this year or you're going to be going forward with this relationship, but an ending has to come in. You have six, two, um, 11, and 29. Six, two, 11, and 29. Okay. So um, this is going to be a wonderful year. I want to wish you guys all the best. Namaste until next time.